Hey guys, this is Lithias and welcome back! Today, we are going to handle the ultimate base building guide. Okay? And if you guys want, I can make this much bigger, but this is just covering the series. Okay, so we're going to um, kill a bear and we're going to build a base. Okay, now, to get started, I'm not going to show you guys the back, otherwise you guys will know where I am, okay? And I um, don't want you guys to raid me. You can try and find me if you know where I am now, but I'm not going to turn around and give it away to you. Okay, so to build a base, you need 20 rocks, 61 lumber, and 2 scrap metal. If you don't have the gatehouse gate guide, you're going to need 62 lumber. Okay, you're just going to need one more lumber, but everything else will stay the same. Okay. And the reason I say that is when you go to base building, you're going to start with the foundation, which is the big foundation. And then you're going to place this big foundation. Do we want it high or do we want the grass to stick out? Yeah, I think we want it low. Yeah, yeah. I think we want it quite low and quite centralized so that we can expand on it. Okay, so that's the foundation. Then you go to walls and you craft three three by four walls. And then we go to doors. And when you have the guide, you create this. Even for a normal lockable door, you're still going to need two scrap metal. That's what the scrap metal is for. And then if we go to platforms, the platform that we need is going to be nine lumber. Okay, the one with the stairs is ten. There, that's nine lumber. And that's all we've got left. We've just got the nine lumber left. So now it's easy. Free mode, snap mode. Free mode, snap mode. I don't know why you're being yonk, wonky on me. You want me to show the people where we are? Guys, I really don't know what's happening here. Don't know if I'm in the twilight zone here because the snapping section is just following me. Okay. Let's not sink this into the ground. And we're not going to let this get us down, alright? We're not going to let this get us down. Okay, let's try this again. Snapping. There we go. There's always a solution. Which way do I want the door? Ah, you're telling them where you are, bro. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. So just snap it on there, jump inside, snap it on there, and there we got your basic base. Do they know where you are? I don't know but I don't care, it's a lovely spot over here, 
very protected okay very high if you know what server i'm on you can try and come and get me so yes now that we've got the basics we only need to craft the storage okay the large crate because when you build a base you're going to make a large crate to keep the stuff in okay and then all you need to do is um take the hatchet and it's going to be 10 lumber and five no oh <laughs> well completely failed with that one yeah it's going to be 25 lumber 25 wood logs because you need 10 lumber and five wood logs for a last trick okay which doesn't take long just love the sunrise <sighs> smell that fresh air and the birds chirping it's just what i love about this game one two three four five six seven eight nine ten we've got 25 okay so the baseball the lumber one two three four five six seven eight nine ten there we go there we go to structures storage we build the other large crate okay 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 i'm putting your brook let me put the crate down here yeah. i'm gonna worry about a bed right now and then we just transport transport all this stuff pick up this one okay where we want to put the other crates we're not sure okay and we're not gonna rush the other crates this is a basic place where we're gonna put cool equipment okay so the guns and the tools everything that we don't need right now okay is going to go into the one so let's put the ammo in there and that and the bullets now i can keep the extra clip the maldino and the other one i put everything board related so my rocks my scrap metal my rope the stuff that i'm going to take to the kiosk later draft bell i keep on me the fat's going to be used for crafting as well and the rest of the stuff we can keep on us okay we're not too heavy but that's the main thing we want to be light now if you're asking yourself why is a base so important okay and if you were wondering how much sheet metal it will take to protect to upgrade all the wooden parts 80 because it's 16 and 16 is 32 okay plus another 32 is going to be 64 plus the platform is going to be another 16 that's 80 okay 80 sheet metal to upgrade everything here and if we go to base building we need two iron ingots for one sheet metal that gives us 160 iron ingots as easy as that okay 160 so how do we make iron ingots <laughs> I 
iron ingots, iron ingots, iron ingots, utilities, iron ingots. That's weird. Okay, let's not waste time on that. Okay, let's just see any subsections there. Rags, decorations, components, utilities, structures. Okay, any case, guys, it is 160, 160 iron ore. Okay, that's what we need to upgrade it. So that's what I'm going to focus on now. Okay. Not going to die with this cool gun on me while I'm hitting iron ore. So I'm willing to lose the... I'm not willing to lose that either. Okay. And since we've got mushrooms... Oh! That's not good. Damn, that wasn't good, man. Alright guys, I'm gonna go hit the 160. But we also need the furnace, which is 32 rocks and 10 scrap metal. We've already gathered the scrap metal. But we need the rocks. But the rocks we're going to get while we get the iron ore. Okay. So I'll be back now. When I've got all, gotten all the iron ore. Very important to work in a relaxed environment, guys. Water. The sounds. And again. When you're hitting an ore deposit. Just move back a bit. Until you don't make a sound anymore. But you still get the resource. Okay probably told you guys that before but that that's very important for just relaxing and then you can press shift tab to take your finger off the mouse if you want to although i'm not very bothered bother, bothered about that and there we go back to 100 percent 35 from that first deposit but yeah, I'm here at the back of Woodhaven. Great view. And I can just relax. Okay guys, we're done. That was quite quick. Okay, so 64 plus 64 is 128. Okay, plus 32 is 160. Okay, so that's all you need. That's all you need to upgrade. Okay. Can we make seven stacks out of this? Sixteen won't take too long. Now let's just fill it up, man. We're just going to fill up the whole furnace with it. And we got 19 rocks while we were busy. Okay. Like I said, that was really quickly. And we only need 32 rocks for the first furnace. Okay, so I'm just gonna hit an I'm just gonna go hit a rock. 19 plus 13. Yeah, 19 plus 13. So let's just go hit a rock quickly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. There we go. 32, eh? 32 rocks. Yeah, guys. And again, don't, don't do something just to do it, okay? Make sure everything's got a purpose. Yes, you can stand there hitting rocks, you know, hitting a rock for longer. But never let it become tedious. The server that you play on. Live yourself into it. Every day is a new day, okay? When when you wake up in real life, you don't do the same thing for the entire day, okay? You touch on everything. 
even if you feel you're working the whole day, okay, that's not what the game is about. The game isn't supposed to feel like work, okay? There is grinding elements to it, but it's how you approach those grinding elements that determines how you experience the game, okay? So, going to go back to the base, and I'll see you when, I, guys, when I'm there. Okay, so here we are. Again, nothing extravagant. Okay, we probably need the scrap metal as well now. Where is the scrap metal? Thank you. So then we're going to craft the furnace. We've got an access of 20 rocks there. But that's not what it's about. I wanted to show you guys that it doesn't take a lot of work. Now we decide where we want to put it. The wood is going to fall down on that side, so I think I want to centralize it here to be nice. Nothing hectic, guys. Nothing hectic. So we're going to put these stacks in here. Okay, so clearly there we can't do everything at once. Okay, so let's just solve that problem quickly. We need 12 more rocks. Six, seven, no, nine, 10, 11, 12. And clearly you guys can see what the speed difference is with the real pickaxe, okay? There's no skipping a beat. So real pickaxe is much better. Get those rocks crafting, craft. So I put this furnace here. Okay. So since we were using 10 slots, it really doesn't matter. It's not going to take that long in any case. And we've got access lumber. Okay, well, let's just use this one to the maximum speed. Okay. And then we split these so that they can go a bit quicker. Put them in here. Well, that's it. Get the wood logs. I don't have access wood logs. Okay. No problem. One. You don't need to hit more wood logs than what you've got. You know, like items. So I'm going to hit 16 wood logs plus 8, 24 wood logs. Quick, quick. Again, not wasting any time. If I move closer, I'll make a sound. And people can hear me, okay, from a distance. Don't want to do that. 16 plus 8 is 24. There we go. 16. There we go. Put the 16 in there. Put the... I don't need 8 for that one. But in any case... 
Yeah, you know, guys, don't don't just just don't complicate it for yourselves. They eh? like I want both stacks equal. Don't worry about stuff like that, man. Okay. And then, of course, that's why we've got the matches. There we go. Now we can do something else, like chop wood. Okay, while we're waiting for that stuff to burn, we can chop wood. We're doing something. We just need to be in the base's vicinity. But we can do something. Okay. Chop wood. Get stone, get iron ore, get, you know, go hit sulfur. And yes, my base is very close to a lot of um, pirate ores, guys. A lot of pirate ores, so I'll be able to make C4s very, very easily. Like I say, you can just keep yourself busy. Keep on gathering the fat. Got access wood there. We can never have enough wood. So. We, we're always going to use wood for crafting. And yes, it's much easier to gather the lumber like I did. Because I literally you know, gathered all that lumber while I was just looting. So that was much faster than me hitting all the wood logs. But I'm going to need wood logs when I start harvesting um, sulfur. Okay? Because you need to turn the wood logs into sticks to get the same amount of coal that you get sulfur. So that's why there's, there's never really a moment where you're wasting time. You can always do something to keep yourself busy. And that's the main thing here. Okay? So I'll be back when we're done. Oh, gee. One way to kill the bear is to aim at him, shoot him in the head till he dies. One way not to kill a bear is to go after it, but I will show you how you make sure that it doesn't kill you. Okay, the way of the samurai. But now I want to test out the trees. I want to fight them in the wild. Stand up again, great one. Okay, okay. You died with honor, my friend. Okay, guys, that's how you kill a bear. Okay, I promised you guys I would kill a bear, and I killed him with a samurai sword. Okay, now a bear, the weakness with a bear is, the reason why I did this, is when a bear runs after you, its, it's animation to hit you takes a while. 
So if you just keep doing this, it will never hit you by because if it runs up to you and it does the animation, like let's say it's behind me now. It's behind me and it wants to do the animation. I do that. Okay, I break the animation. And that's why why I could play with him like I played with him there. Okay, because his animation takes some time. So when he does the animation, I can you know, swing on him or hit him in his face or whatever. But yeah, boys, that's how easy it is to kill a bear. I really, I really didn't think I could do it, but I did it. First year, Luthias, Black Widow, Bear, Nati Pupitu. Nati Pupitu, my bro. Okay, guys, let's get back to the base and just finish this episode. So, there we go. We've got 160, which is 80 sheet metal. And we just carry on, boys. We just carry on. So we need the workbench, which is 10 lumber, 5 scrap metal, and 4 iron ingots. Really? <laughs> really want to tell me I'm going to be 4 iron ingots short? That is some funny stuff, man. Oh, blind guys. Yeah, I'm blind. There's the scrap metal. Goodness gracious me, man. Let's just do this. Where do we could we don't we don't mind because they can destroy this if they want to. I don't mind. I'm gonna work outside. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna work outside. Okay, now now this thing doesn't look like it's the right way around. Okay, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna work from outside. Craft using workbench, base building, and let's do the sheet metal. I'm gonna be too, too short. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh no. No, for you. Okay, guys, I upgraded the foundation by mistake. And that takes a lot of. Um, Iron ore. I think it's 32. But in any case, I'm gonna finish these parts off camera, okay? If I didn't waste that, I could have upgraded everything. Okay, because the calculations make sense to you. It's 80 sheet metal. Okay, now I just wasted 32 sheet metal on a freaking foundation. So yes, if you enjoyed this episode, please click the like button. If you're not subscribed yet, subscribe and then click that notification um, bell to be notified of future videos as I try my best to upload at least once a day. Okay, skipping odd days here and there, but that is my objective. So yeah, see you guys again. Um, hope you have fun.
And that is so funny. It is so funny. It's so funny crafting shit little. Oh, I don't need that extra one. Close. Jump. Upgrade to play this. Okay, so yeah, those th th that 32. The top and that. The, f the platform stole 32. Okay, and I must use it there. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Cheers.